Alright, so I got a battle here with some shitsy or crapsy or poopsy or something like that from Skype. So, yeah, I look at his team for a while and then I decide he's either going to lead off with Zorak or Kajando. In both cases, Jirachi should be able to handle those quite well. And he sends out Kajando, goes for the fake out, so, um... I go for the Iron Head here just in case it was Kajan. I mean, just in case it was the, the Zorark thing. But since he goes for the fake out, it is a real Kajando. So now I go for the, the Stealth Rock. And yeah, I predict that thing. So I didn't go for the Iron Head again. And thankfully, because I flinched, I'm able to switch moves. Because I never actually used the move. But yeah, I could have gone for the trick, expecting the Natori. But I wasn't really too sure how this guy plays. So. I just decided to go for my stealth rock, play it safe, cause I might want I might want to trick something later on, and yeah. So he brings in Natori as I expected. So I'm gonna switch out, go to my Shofu, and for some reason he stays in here, which is like whatever. I think he missed a leech seed or something, so that probably maybe mattered a little bit. I probably would have had like 10% less HP, but I don't know. So in comes back Kajando. And again, I'm expecting the fake out, so I go to Gengar, take it like a boss because it doesn't affect me. So I'm pretty sure he's gonna switch, so I'm gonna go for a sub, and he brings in an Mboar thing. And I kind of fuck up here because I was doing homework, Johns, but for real, I was doing homework. But what I should have done here was go to Latios, since that Mboar thing is pretty much a shitty ass Infernape, and my Latios is pretty much a less defensive Latias and Latias is pretty much one of the best um, Infernape counters so if that makes any sense Latios takes this fool on and I decide to be a dumbass cuz like I noticed the way he was playing I'm probably not gonna have too much trouble beating this guy so I don't really have to think too much I was focusing on homework Johns again but seriously no Johns cuz it doesn't matter like I said I, I should still be able to win cuz it doesn't look like this guy's is too experienced so go to Ron Jeremy specs Ron Jeremy destroys anything so down he goes and now he sends out a scissor so he could either pursue U-turn Swords Dance or something else and he decides to go for the bug bite I go to Natori since I thought I would be resisting some shit and um apparently he's like um leftover so that tells me he's probably a Swords Dancing set so what I'm going to have to do now is go for the Lee Cheat, get the fuck out of there because I can't really kill him and I don't want him to get the plus 6. So expecting the second Swords Dance, I'm going to go to Jirachi and then as he Swords Dance, the next round I'm going to go for Trick and then see what the fuck he locks himself into and then I could adjust accordingly. But he decides to predict because he's a fucking professional, just kidding, but I don't know if that was a prediction, but it worked out for him really good because now my shit died. Which is pretty bad, but I don't know why he didn't go for the plus four since he had the perfect opportunity to. Maybe he was expecting HP fire not to rate LOL, but seriously, that shit fucked me up. So, not to rate dies, but he's at minus two defense, neutral attack. I know my Landros could take bullet punches pretty much any day, especially since he's got some HP invested as you can see. But he gets a crit, which is fucking amazing, but... Yeah, since he's at minus two defense, Earthquake will easily be able to take his shit out. And now he's got um um that thing, the Kajando, and um this guy and uh, the Zorak. So he goes out to Sanzadora, which is like whatever. If he's not scarfed, I'm gonna be able to fuck his shit up. If he's scarfed, he's not gonna be able to kill me unless he goes for Dark Pulse. And he does go for the Dark Pulse, but I still got this in the bag, even though I'm down 3-1. to one. Um, He's not. He's either going to stay in here and let me set up, or he's going to switch out to Kajando and hope to get off some fake outs and shit. So I predict the switch, go for the, for the, for the Drain Punch, then I was going to go for the Mach Punch. But he keeps on staying in here, so I'm thinking, alright, maybe I should just try to set up and then um, beat him. But he gets a Crit Flinch. And then right here he gets another flinch, which is fucking amazing, since now I'm gonna lose even though I had this shit in the bag. If he didn't get a crit, or if he didn't get two flinches, I would've won, because he got Kajando, and he also has, fuck, who the hell's calling? He also has a fucking Zorark, which is not gonna be sash since I did get up Stealth Rock, so I was gonna be able to win. But this 
fucking game decides to flinch me and somebody's calling on the fucking phone and I lose. Never fucking battle me in real life because if you get a crit, I will punch someone in the face and it will most likely be you. But seriously, I get fucking heated as you can tell. Anyway, comment, rate, all that shit. I'm out.